Imagine a world where the air itself could kill you. This wasn't a monster, it was the planet. 300 million years ago, Earth was covered in lush, alien-like forests. Towering trees reached for the sky, and strange plants blanketed the ground. This era, known as the Carboniferous Period, was a paradise for life. Gigantic insects crawled through the undergrowth. Dragonflies the size of eagles soared through the air. The world was green, vibrant, and full of energy. But this paradise held a deadly secret. The sheer volume of plants was pumping insane amounts of oxygen into the atmosphere. Today, our air is about 21% oxygen. Back then, it was over 35%. This oxygen-rich environment supercharged life, making creatures grow to enormous sizes, but it also turned the entire planet into a tinderbox. All it took was a single spark, a lightning strike hitting a dry leaf, a volcanic eruption spitting out embers. The super-oxygenated air would ignite. Not just a forest fire, the air itself would catch fire. A wall of flame, thousands of feet high, would sweep across continents at unimaginable speeds. Anything in its path was instantly incinerated. There was no escape, no hiding. The ground would shake as the inferno consumed everything. The sky would turn black with ash, blocking out the sun for years. These global firestorms were extinctional-level events, wiping out countless species in a flash. The very thing that gave life its incredible size and power also became its ultimate destroyer. And here's the truly terrifying part. Scientists believe these oxygen spikes and global firestorms happened multiple times. This wasn't a one-time accident. It was a cycle of death and rebirth written into the very fabric of our planet's history. These ancient fires were more destructive than any asteroid, and the world they burned was just one of many that came before us.